I should probably go to sleep first because it's like 3 o'clock in the morning. Oh, I wish it looked like this at 3 o'clock in the morning. Fuck you. Hello, everybody. My name is Miss Ray Ray, and welcome back to Breath of the Wild. See? That was so much better. And as you can see, I am not starting in the Resurrection Temple again. I wanted to know how to get to our yellow mark. And it turns out it is on top of a snowy hill. But as you, you will see our problem very s shortly. Um, if we go into snowy areas and our temperature thermometer goes to the cold part, Link will take damage. So we need to find a way to keep him warm through the snow. And as it just so happened, last episode, if you can remember, we found spicy peppers. And it said if we could cook them, then we could be cold resistant. So I was looking for peppers, and look what I just found, guys! You are here with me! I just found them! That's so... Okay, well, I mean, like, take. Yes. I'm braving the cold for just a second. Is it, Are they over here? Oh, there's some right here. Okay, take, 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 take. Take as many as I can. Okay. No, don't do that. Okay. So... Now I need to cook it. I don't want to disturb the Bokoblins, those guys are just... Please don't notice me. They're not noticing me. That's good. Good, 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 good. There was a thing to cook over at that guy's camp. That I could probably go to. I mean, I can go to, so. There's nothing I can see over here, so I might need to go over there. And that's gonna... Ugh, that's gonna take so much time. Oh my god, guys! Look at this! This was the water fountain in Ocarina of Time! This was the middle of Castle Town! This was the middle of Castle Town. Shit. There it is. Okay, so I want to cook the peppers. Hi, guy. I kind of already learned how to cook on my own, so sorry if that was a tutorial you wanted to show me. Let's see what one pepper does, and then go from there. I want to see how much one pepper helps me resist the cold. That's a really cute animation. Spicy sauteed peppers is two and a half minutes. Is that game? That can't be game time because time passes way too fast around here. Grants low level cold resistance. The spiciness of these sauteed peppers has been broken by the heat of the of, for a sweeter taste. Okay. So, I have like a ten peppers now. So let's see what two does. Let's see if that adds time. Or if I'm just wasting peppers. <laughs> Five minutes! Okay, so... Oh, the thing about cooking was that you could, like, combine things. So let's do a pepper, an apple, and, I don't know, stamina? Let's see if this gives me heat resistance, too. Other than just, you know, sauteed stuff. No, it just gives me simmer fruit, but it... Gives me three hearts, so let's do pepper again, and I don't think I want to add a butterfly to it. Herbs. Spicy herbs. That and three minutes. Oh, and five. That's too many hearts. Gives me six heart health. And three resistance to cold. That's... I just... I'll have to keep that. But, like, that's... I don't have that many hearts yet. So... Uh... Yeah. Let's cook three. See how many that gives us. And I think that should be enough for us to be able to reach... Seven and a half minutes. Okay, I think... 
that plus the five plus the two and a half minutes will be able will get us safely to this one because all of this is cold so let's go to the shrine resurrection because that's where I started to get my vantage point to the shrine and see where we can go from there Monster ingredients. If you combine monster parts dropped by fallen foes in a cooking pot, things like lizards and butterflies, you can create elixirs with special effects. Nice. But the old guy didn't the no, he didn't. I thought the old guy said something about lizards or cooking or something. I don't think he did. Like when he was by the fire the first time. Okay, so. Mm-hmm. Okay. Even in here, it's kind of chilly. Thermometer says. Maybe it's just because there's water everywhere and this is a damp cold cave. Who knows? Hmm. Where did I start? I started right here. So, let's just climb up. And we'll be at the shrine soon. Oh, you know what? I think this is a short enough distance I can jump. And not have to worry about losing too much stamina. See, it's right there. But it's, like, directly in the cold. That's how I figured out that cold will hurt you. I haven't died from the cold yet. But, hmm... That looks sad. Like that's. I hope there's something over there that can help me cross that bridge. Uh, it's probably getting really high at this point for me. I should probably go. Okay. So. Okay. Okay. I got you. I got you. Let's try the five-minute one. Okay. Oh, so once it, like, okay, just jump. Oh, okay, so if it gets, if I could, I'm still affected by the cold, but my cold, me, my, oh, d please don't come alive. That would be great if you didn't. I don't think you are. No, you're not. Okay, cool. Ancient shaft? Nope, I'm not making that joke. Okay. Nice. Ancient gears. Okay. What to do? I'm wasting seconds. You look metal. Can I... I can affect you. Yes. I like this. Okay, up. Up a bit. Up. And then... No, 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 wait, shit. Ah. Okay, so. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, okay, so close. I don't have a choice. I am running out of time. I don't think I can scale that. I think I have to go around a bit. Okay. Look at it. Look at my shorts. I'm wearing capris. Okay. Well, I mean, yes, this still kind of goes up. So, up further, or this is letting me. This is making me scale a mountain. This is not good. Oh, wait. Wait. Promise? This is promise. I'm still going up, technically. Mm -hmm. Yes, this is good. Okay. Is that... A I can. Okay, so I can... Oh, that was bad. Why did I do that? I'm close to this, though, so it should be okay. Ooh, I'm almost there. Guys, like, I'm almost right on top of the shrine. 
Okay, good. <gasps> I am right here! Kenamut Shrine. Kenamut. Yes, this is good. I hope I am not like freezing. I hope my timer doesn't run on a freeze to death in that shrine though. That's gonna suck. So. Yay! Oh, this is exciting. What am I gonna do if my time runs out though in the when I come out here? I don't I don't I won't die instantly. I got hurt before, but I didn't die. I don't die instantly. These bombs are useful not only for dealing damage to monsters, okay. And they can break stuff. Gee, I didn't know that. To you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Kehnamut. In the name of the goddess Helia, I offer this trial. <laughs> Look at the little thing. I'm trying to grab my butt. Cryonis trial? Cryonis. Cry. Like. Like. Cryostasis? Like freezing things? Sheikah Slate authenticated. Distilling rune. Oh my god, I love that. <sighs> what is this? Oh, yeah. Frost. Create a pillar of ice from water surface. Rune extracted. Puts ice pillars that are very stable. These pillars can be used as stepping stones or as obstacles. Use cryonis an ice pillar to break it. Oh. So I can make or break ice. Cool. And hey, look, there's water. Perfect for me to try out. Perfect for me to try it out. <laughs> Oh, see, it's... Look at my thermometer. It's not cold in here at all. So... Nope. Name outward. Yes. Apparently, if I press the down button... I can... Aw. I mean, that would've... It's, it's super cool, but... It, I'm being picky. This is a nice Zelda game. I was just gonna say... If I saw the water, like, going down because the ice was building up, that would have been super cool. Oh, I probably could have been stepping on that. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Nope. Oh, God. He can't go down. <gasps> he can't go down. Oh, he can aim up. Shit. Okay, so. He can't see me. Nope. I'm just gonna keep erecting water things to shield me from his gaze. Ooh! Can he move from that? I'm not technically in his gaze. Nice. He can't get me from here. Good set. Please don't tell me he can get me from up here. No. Okay, good. Where is. Oh, he's right there. Duh, I was staring right at him. That is some. What? Nope, 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 nope. He can deal. Actually, you know what? You know what that reminds me of so much? That reminds me of like the sand rods from um, Link to the Past and Link Between Worlds. That's what it reminds me of. 
Probably because they come out of the ground from, like, squares. That's probably what it comes from. Your resource? Oh yeah, I've, I've seen this. This is the same thing. I'm pressing the wrong button to skip. Spirit orb! Nice! And I got on my heart's back. May the goddess smile upon you. Yeah, we saw this one too. He floats away in little beams. The power allows you to halt time for certain objects, completely stopping them in place. I know what stasis is. Time flies. Monsters thrive at nighttime. Do as do other things that can adventuring can make adventuring dangerous. If you lull your hearts at night. Okay. Oh. Where the fuck did you come from? You would have had to come off of right there, which is not on the plains. Ah, oh, God, this guy. Okay. With this, you have now acquired all of the spirit orbs from the shrines on this plateau. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. extraordinary. <laughs> that means it is finally time. Link, it is finally time for me to tell you everything. But first. It's like super cold. Can you like give me your hoodie or something? You have a beard that covers your entire face. Mark an X on your map with the four shrines as the endpoints. Find the spot where those lines intersect. I shall wait for you there. Do you understand? Where two lines connecting the shrines would cross, there I will be. Okay, I am like super cold, so let's fi figure out where that is right now. And I'm actually going to keep this going for just a little bit because that looks like some much needed plot and exposition. And I don't want to leave you guys hung up. To wait for next week because I think I'm only doing four episodes this week anyway charge attack you can ready a charge but why oh okay so red charge by what okay yeah oh yeah we I think I did that I'm not sure if I did that but like his little circle thing like and boom yeah see how did that not break okay wait yeah um Okay, so straight this way. It's right there. And the one thing I keep going toward is the Temple of Time. I think I need to. I think I need to go to the Temple of Time, guys. So there I shall go. Oh, you know what? I can actually do this now. And I can climb it! Nice. Then do anything. But I should probably break it. But I don't want it to be there later. Okay, so to the shrine we go. It is it's about time I go over there anyway. It's been like what? Four episodes, four days for you guys, and uh like hours, hour and a half for me. And it's right here. I mean, come on. Oh, the fire's out. Why is the fire out? Why was the guy all ghosty? Oh, he left his baked apple. I guess he doesn't need it. Oh, torch. I can't carry any more weapons. Ooh, there's something shiny in there. Oh, I didn't land in the circle. I want to land in the circle. Sorry, I want to... I should probably get on with the story first. And not die in a pond next to the Temple of Time. Because I'm right here, guys. I'm saying, guys, like, you're the ones making me do this, but it's not. It's me. I'm the one making me do this. Oh, I can't. Ooh! You're not alive yet? Oh, more screws. Cool. I was about to scream, because I thought that would kill me. 
Uh-huh. Nothing? Okay, stop that. I just wanted to run. Pots? Nope. <gasps> Pots! Yes! Aw. Forgot. Nice. All uh, odes to classics. Yay! This is great. It's the Temple of Time, guys. Did I just hear an owl? I get so distracted so easily. You... You're not alive, right? No. You're not. Can I search you? I can't search. Ooh, more screws. Cool. Why? Oh! Shit, you scared me. Oh, God, you scared the crap out of me. Here, beat you with your own club. Ooh! Is that... Is that the angel statue from, like, Skyward Sword? Oh my god. Is this, like, the beginning of the Doom timeline? Hmm. You who have conquered the shrines and claimed their spirit orbs. I can offer you great power. It appears you have claimed four spirit orbs. In exchange for four spirit orbs, I will amplify your being. So tell me, what is it that you desire? Ooh, I can get longer stamina or... Duh, I'm gonna get a heart container. You wish for another heart container, yes? I shall grant you the power you seek. Oh my god, those are so pretty! I want a necklace of that! Oh my god, that's so fucking pretty. Da -da -da! Your life force has been strengthened, increasing your maximum number of hearts by one. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. Oh! What? I can't move the camera to find you now. What the fuck are you doing up there? The blessing of the goddess has made you that much more resilient, I see. Hmm. Here I am. Get up here, quickly. <laughs> okay, well, before I was rudely interrupted, I was gonna say, don't these statues kind of look like the ones that we would hit in the games? And they would, like, bounce up and down and tell you how long we've been playing the game? That's kind of what it looks like. It reminds me of, anyway. You're not alive, are you? More screws. Okay, more screws. I could probably climb him. Gain stamina. I have to go all the way up here. Almost there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Okay. There I go. Okay, I'm like up on the top of the roof. Where are you? Up at a higher top of the roof. Okay. <laughs> well Cutscene. done there, young one. Oh, I gave it the right voice. Cool. Now then. The time has come to show you who I truly am. I was King Rome Bosphoramus Hyrule. Bosphoramus, that's a... I was the last leader of Hyrule. A kingdom which no longer exists. <laughs> Wait, the last king the of Hyrule? So is this like at merciless. the end? It devastated everything in its path, lo, a century ago. It was then that my life was taken away from me. And since that time, here I have remained in spirit form. I did not think it wise to overwhelm you while your memory was still fragile. So rather than that, 
I thought it best to assume a temporary form. Forgive me. I think you are now ready. Ready to hear what happened 100 years ago. To know Calamity Ganon's true form, one must know the story from an age long past. The Demon King was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Born into the king, so he's highly in this one? Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. But there was also a prophecy. The signs of a resurrection of Calamity Ganon are clear, and the power to oppose it lies dormant beneath the ground. We decided to heed the prophecy and began excavating large areas of land. It wasn't long before we discovered several ancient relics made by the hands of our distant ancestors. These relics the Divine Beasts were giant machines piloted by warriors. We also found the Guardians, an army of mechanical soldiers who fought autonomously. This coincided with ancient legends oft repeated throughout our land. We also learned of a princess with a sacred power. And She's her pretty. And knight chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power of these ancient relics. One hundred years ago, there was a princess set to inherit a sacred power and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear that we must follow our ancestors' path. We selected four skilled individuals from across Hyrule and task them with the duty of piloting the Divine Beasts. With the Princess as their commander, we dubbed these pilots Champions, a name that would solidify their unique bond. The Princess, her appointed knight, and the rest of the Champions were on the brink of sealing away Ganon. But nay. Ganon was cunning and he responded with a plan beyond our imagining. He appeared from deep below Hyrule Castle, seized control of the Guardians and the Divine no! I can't fight those, they're gigantic! Champions lost their lives, those residing in the castle as well. The appointed knight gravely wounded and collapsed while defending the princess. And thus, the kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely by Calamity Ganon. However, the princess survived to face Ganon alone. Link, you are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. See, that's straight up a pig. You only see Pig Ganon in like the Doom timeline. Sorry. I'm like ruining the moment. I'm very, very sorry. But like, that was straight up Castletown. Devastated. That princess was my own daughter. The only time you see Hyrule devastated is during the Doom timeline. Sorry. And the People like, keep knight saying this is like after Wind Waker, Twilight right Princess. I'm like, no. Very end. That night was none other than you, Link. You fought valiantly when your fate took an unfortunate turn. And then you were taken to the Shrine of Resurrection. Here you now stand, revitalized 100 years later. The words of guidance you have been hearing since your awakening are from Princess Zelda herself. Even now, as she works to restrain Ganon from within Hyrule Castle, she calls out for your help. However, my daughter's power will soon be exhausted. Once that happens, Ganon will freely regenerate himself 
and nothing will stop him from consuming our land. Considering that I could not save my own kingdom, I have no right to ask this of you, Link. But I am powerless here. You must save her, my daughter, and do whatever it takes to annihilate Ganon. Somehow, Ganon has maintained control over all four divine beasts, as well as those guardians swarming around Hyrule Castle. I believe it would be quite reckless for you to head directly to the castle at this point. No, oh, now I just want to. I suggest that you make your way east out to one of the villages in the wilderness. Follow the road out to Kakariko Village. There you will find the Elder Impa. She will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. Consult the map on your Shiga slate for the precise location of Kakariko Village. Make your way past the twin summits of the dueling peaks. From there, follow the road as it proceeds north. Hmm. Go on. Here is the parag oh, go on. Here's the paraglider, just as I promised. <laughs> Okay, but okay, so here's my thing. That's he said the last king of Hyrule, meaning it is no longer a monarchy, meaning that, like, this has to be the Doom timeline. Like, there's no more kings. Like, even in the Wind Waker timeline, there were still kings. And I think that's it. Hmm. I, I think I skipped dialogue there by accident. I've told you everything I can. Link, you must save Hyrule. Okay, nice. Destroy Ganon. You know what I'm kind of miffed at? There wasn't even a time where I could go into here, and I sort of wanted to. I was been around here. I get a spiral, but I didn't go in here, so I think that's what I'm going to do before I start next episode, guys. Ooh! Finally, I get a bow! Ooh! Draw my bow. So it's like taps, not like hold. Okay, well, I just wasted an arrow. Let me... No, wrong ones. Paraglider. Okay, I use B. Sorry, I want. Let's get down here before I end the episode. Let me go and get my arrow back. For God's sake. Oh, I think it landed down there. Let me crouch. Oh yeah, it landed right there. Oh, I didn't want to fight you. Okay, 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 I get it. Hey, stop that! What were those? Keys! Keys wings! I need my arrow back, thank you. Okay, so anyway, guys, leaving this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I very, very much appreciate it. I want to see all of you in the next video. Have a wonderful life. Next episode, I should probably go towards the pinpoint. So, 